The London mayor has been blasted as he completes just 71 new affordable homes in three months. The Tories are demanding that the government place Sadiq Khan under special measures, as the number of new affordable housing starts in London last quarter were an abysmal 71. New stats from the Greater London Assembly, published yesterday, showed that despite a housing crisis in the capital, Sadiq Khan started just 150 affordable homes during the last quarter, and completed fewer than half that number. The abysmal figures come despite the mayor needing to deliver approximately 3,000 new affordable homes every quarter in order to meet his target of building 25,000 affordable homes in the next two years. According to these figures, therefore, Mr. Khan achieved just 2.3% of his quarterly housing target. In a letter to Housing Secretary Angela Rayner, the Tories' housing spokesman in London Lord Bailey has demanded that she now put party political differences aside and intervene for the sake of struggling Londoners. Lord Bailey notes that the new Labour government has been absolutely clear that it is your priority as Secretary of State and Deputy Prime Minister to increase the number of homes built across the country. Reacting to the new housing start figures, Lord Bailey says they are clearly unacceptably low, and are inconsistent with the house-building ambitions of both your department and the manifesto on which the Labour government was elected on last month. He said, Over the last eight years, the Mayor of London has consistently demonstrated that he is unable to meet the scale of London's housing challenges, with the number of new homes built in the capital falling to record lows under Sadiq Khan's leadership. We are, therefore, urging you to use your powers as Secretary of State to place the Mayor of London and the GLA in special measures. Without tailored support and additional oversight from your department, sadly it is abundantly clear that Sadiq Khan will not be able to deliver the number of homes London requires, and that targets alone are no longer enough to tackle the scale of the problem.